Well, we started seeing a little bit of some light snow this morning and then also for the afternoon. Anywhere from, you know, a dusting to the sidewalks being covered. Uh, DeKalb had 1.4 inches so far, while Joliet 2 inches, and at noon just over an inch in Rockford. So we'll continue to see still a little bit more snow. Let's go right to our satellite <coughs> and radar. <laughs> One time I was on air, this was when I was in Quincy, I sneezed like seven times in one of my weathers, and it was live, so there was nothing I could do about it. It's the funniest thing that probably ever happened to me on air. God bless myself. Okay, so there's the light snow. It's already um, pushing towards the east, and we're going to continue to see this little clipper move out of the area. What's behind it? Well, more cloud cover, and yes, another clipper that's going to clip us and bring us a little bit more light snow. So all we're talking about is light snow in this forecast. So Friday, 9.30 in the morning, we'll squeeze out maybe just a few little flurries. More clouds throughout the day, of course. That would be the fifth day in a row that we have seen total cloud cover. And then Saturday, late Saturday night into early Sunday, still a little bit more snow. Now, what we could see set up on Sunday is a little bit of some lake effect snow as those winds come out of the north or just out of the northeast. So we'll keep an eye on that, but there are some areas that could get even some snow on Sunday. So how much snow? Well, we've already seen about 600 of an inch of snow at O'Hare, but we're going to continue to see maybe another inch, inch and a half after these clippers come through. Tonight, however, a little patchy fog out there under mostly cloudy skies, 16 to 22 with the winds out of the west, northwest, and then those winds will switch even warm us up a few more degrees, 27 to 33. We're squeezing out just a few flurries in the morning. Otherwise, we'll be under mostly cloudy skies. Saturday night into Sunday, we'll have some snow. Sunday, a few lake effect snow showers, 30 degrees. Monday, 25, and then by Tuesday, 22. The good news with the seven-day forecast is that Monday and Tuesday, yeah, we could get some more snow, but temperatures aren't going to be as cold as what we've been talking about before. It looks like the coldest air is going to move a little bit more to the east. We're still going to see temperatures come down and be well below average, but it's not going to be like that frigid Arctic air that we have seen about a week and a half ago. I'm meteorologist Duffy Atkins in the WGN Weather Center, where it is definitely weather.